you know, in football, you can give at any level a team three goals the way we did in, I think it was less than 10 minutes. Uh, you know, it's unacceptable from us, from our point of view as players. And we just didn't look ourselves in the first 30 minutes, really. And then again, second half is chalk and cheese. You know, we came out, we have nothing to lose. It's a little bit easier. They sit in, but we have to start games like that because we had been, what was it, 23 games unbeaten at home and a real force here. And then we turn up like that and, and show that effort, which was the disappointing thing. I think in the first half, we didn't control there and we didn't, we kept giving the ball away, turnovers, and it was just not us. So, you know, unacceptable. But again, second half, we didn't give in, we kept going. Probably could have scored a couple more goals, but consistency from the start of the season really has not been there compared to last season. You know, you talk about LFC, great result. Kansas, not so. Seattle, great result, not tonight. So it's like we need to, if we want to be a great team, which we, you know, we were decent last year, not a great team, but we didn't do anything, but we were a better team and consistency, that's all it is, you know, away from home, at home. And tonight we didn't show, well, not tonight, the first 45 minutes wasn't us and we know we have to be better and it's unaccept unacceptable, yeah, sorry. Just be us, continue, you know, every time we play here, we're, we're a good team and for some reason this year away from home, we've not been as <clears throat> as good, really, to be honest. We've, you know, been a bit poor on the road, but for some reason the first 15 20 minutes we looked a little bit scared like we we were worried about them and i don't know why because we've never been like that against anyone here you know lafc seattle two you know big dogs of the league and you know we could we, we smash them over the park so i it's a it's a good question it's a tough one to to answer really i, f I feel like when we we're engaged in the game i hear the gaffer talk all the time about that and we're focused and we know our jobs and we we go out and perform it's not necessarily work rate because tonight we were still working hard, but we weren't getting anywhere near the ball. So it's it's not a work rate problem. I just think it's a little bit up here. And but yeah, we if we want to be a team that wins trophies and wins MLS Cup, we need to be more consistent. And especially here at home, putting in that first forty five minutes is is not good. From the like you say, from the first whistle, we we had, even when we had the ball, we turned it over. Mm -hmm. Confidence then dips. Yeah. We then start doing things that we don't usually do. And but like you say, we didn't get enough pressure to them they had a lot of time on the ball listen at times we say if you have the ball in the back three or the back four you plan, that's fine we're, we're happy but we were compact tonight we weren't compact it was like one or two were going and then everyone else was a bit late and it just yeah there was no rhythm it, it, tonight there was no rhythm and for whatever reason we just we weren't at the races and it's a shame because now we don't play for three weeks and it's going to sit on our minds for a while and but you know that's what we're going to have to deal with. We're going to have to work hard for the next three weeks and be ready for, for New York. But yeah, it, it, it just wasn't right. And I, I, it's hard to put a thing on it. Turnovers, not enough pressure on the ball. And to be honest, the first 20 minutes was, we made it really easy for them. For a team that's coming here in altitude, too easy for them. Yeah, no, I agree. I think Will, myself, Danny, there was, I think it wasn't until after the second goal where we were like, let's calm it down a bit. Maybe we say it earlier. I mean, we still go concede the third goal. so. I don't know if that made would have made much, too much difference, but yeah, we needed more character, probably including myself at times out there tonight when you know it gets a bit tough. Maybe just say, listen, Will, we're not playing out from the back tonight. We're just going to go big, second balls. You know, be, make it scrappy because football's not all about the pretty stuff. Uh, so for sure, could have done more myself for sure. Uh, I was a little bit shocked the way we conceded the goals, to be honest as well. So maybe I look at myself and say, I've got to, I've got to, just got to get out of my head and, and get the boys going. But I was a little bit surprised the way we defended some of the goals and. Maybe it took me back a little bit because it, it was just it, the whole stadium was stunned after, especially after the third goal going. Mean, it's almost like what's going on here. But no, yeah, for sure we need need more leadership, probably including myself in the first first thirty minutes to get the boys back on back on track. Yeah, because we've come against that a lot this year, and teams know if they come here and do that, they had a bit of joy. They did last year. I think we had that stretch where we drew three games. I think nil nil at home, and that's what teams do. And you know, it's probably credit to us because we're a really good team here. And we, we have to expect that from teams to come. You know, we knew Nashville were solid. They were going to sit back at times and absorb the pressure because that's, you know, the way they are. But even at home, they do that. So we had to do more on the ball. Boys looking for the ball, not hiding. You know, as simple as that. It's brutally honest. I think we need to be, show more character. Uh, you make a mistake, just dust it off and go again. And I felt in the first, especially in the first half, we didn't want the ball. There was too many players that were just, not not interested and that can't happen we need that like you say we talk about engagement the whole time boys have to want the ball it's it's a game like we lost 3-1 so you might as well just show some some whatever I can't say it but you know what I mean you just can't so uh, 
but yeah, disappointing because even second half we got into some decent areas, but then probably the final ball let us down at times with the crossing and. Uh, but listen, we'll we'll go and work on it again, and you know, even myself, like, I'm not trying to dig anyone out. I'm, you know, I give the ball away a little bit too often, so it's it's part and parcel of the game, and we have to dust ourselves off and go again. I thought he was brilliant. Yeah, no, he was probably the only bright spark we had when he came on. To be honest, he was the Mikey of old. You know, we haven't seen that too much this season, but when he's like that, he's unstoppable. The fullback didn't have a you know a clue what to do, and it's. It's what we need from him, and like I say, he was brilliant. He got into some great areas. You know, on another day, he could have got a few assists and maybe even a goal himself. So, no, I thought he was good. He, he's the Mikey we know that was, and like you all know, you know what he's like. One v one, he's you know he's deadly. So, if he can continue to do that for us, it would be fantastic. And no, he was he was really good tonight. No, good shift from the boy. Yeah, for sure. I think like you say there, you look in the mirror. You know, everyone is culpable like I'm not sitting here blaming other people myself I need to look at myself I haven't played like I did last season so everyone needs to go and have a hard look at themselves and continue to work you know we have two weeks now where we're going to have a couple of games for Rapids too and get some minutes because we're not going to stop working so it's not a rest it's just a shame that we haven't got a game in three days because you want to just get this one out of the way and go again but we'll dwell on it but I think the gaffer said in there he said it perfectly use it as motivation for the next couple of weeks to get working and you know still have it in the back of your mind what happened tonight and then when we go to New York, you know, we need to see a reaction. It's as simple as that. And if and if we don't, we have problems. So we, we need to go there and just be aggressive and go after them because we have nothing to lose. You know, that's how we have to play. Like, we have nothing to lose. Like, no one expects us to be good. No one expects us to win. So last season, no one expected us. And we just went out, no fear, and played. And for some reason this year, at times, we haven't. So we need to get back to that for sure. Yeah. Yeah, listen, words were said, you know, from players, staff. Gaffer's not one to dig out players and rant and rant and, you know, get angry. But he talks and you, you listen and you understand. And listen, we're not idiots. We don't come in and go, you know, we did all right. I did all right. You know, it's, it's you know, we're not idiots. So like I say, we knew he doesn't need to come in and start effing and blinding. We, we understand what we weren't good enough. And as players, like you say, we have to take more responsibility. It's easy at half time or after the game to say something, but why not make a difference out there? And like I say, myself, when the first two or three goals go in just show a bit more a bit more leadership uh, tonight we didn't lack work rate but we did lack that little a bit of bite and bit of fight and unlike us I think it's unlike us you know there's games where we've won here most of the games we've won here has come from winning that battle first and then playing tonight we just thought maybe it was all about playing and we weren't good enough at that so uh, yeah it wasn't a big you know shouting contest in there because listen it was you know how bad it was so it's it's one of them, but like you say, we we needed to show a bit more in the second half, and and I am proud of the boys because we did go out there and we could have caved in and we didn't, and probably could have scored a couple more. And on another day, you never know if you win that four three or you draw three three, but it wasn't to be tonight.